Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Today, me and Randy P. Daughter out here on the river. We're going scouting for some geese, but we're going to be doing some fishing as well. So you guys will be seeing some fishing action today. Hopefully we find some fish and catch some fish. A lot of smallmouth, suckers, carp, largemouth. You just never know. There could be some walleye or pike in here. But really the goal is definitely the smallies and the largemouth. So throwing around a few different things today. Maybe some moving baits. Probably some slow sinking around some trees, docks. We'll just see what happens. It's super shallow. Water's pretty clear today. And it's just a beautiful day out. Beautiful day to be out here in nature and see if we can find some fish. Yeah, the mosquitoes have been horrible as well. I don't know if those are mosquitoes or not, but not today. Just in the past probably month. What are you using? A rattle trap, but I'm thinking about switching over. Your swim bait would work fine. This, I think it might be too big, unless I find a giant smallmouth. I'm sure they're out here. Oh yeah, I know they are. But uh, the chances of me catching a giant one with the water this hot, probably low. What is going on over there? Those are fish. Did you see that one jump over the log? Yeah. It jumped over that log. I'm gonna go over there. I wonder if they're stuck on a trot line or something. It jumped over that log. I don't see any lines. That was a trash cast. Big fish, big, big. Holy smokes. Please still be on here. This is by far my biggest smallmouth of my life. Dad, I need your help, man. Hurry up. No. Oh. My. Gosh. Huh. I'm shaking to death. That's taxidermy worthy. <laughs> mm -hmm. Remember I said there's no chance I catch a big one? I guess I was wrong. I don't even know why I have this in my bag, but I do. Do you happen to have any batteries in your boat? What do you mean? We'll never know. You mean weight-wise? No, hell no. Why would I have batteries? Really? We'll never know. <laughs> Dude, you know. That's three and a half. Okay, that's got to be. There you go. And what's a, what's a what's the state record? Like nine. <laughs> it ain't a nine pounder hey will you come back over here for a second check out that absolute monster got to be at least three and a half and it's for sure in the 20 inch range do you have a tape no neither one of us have a tape or batteries i've got a scale but it's dead but look at that absolute beast this is the biggest smallmouth by far of my life and i'll never know the weight but here we go we are going to put her back ready I'd say she was ready. <laughs> as long as there's no log jam, I'm happy to go anywhere. These are 
There's a bald eagle. That is neat. That thing looked like it had a seven foot wingspan. I don't think I've seen a mature one in a while. How'd you like to tell people you own land that has bald eagles just chilling out on it? This is what I was using. Little Lou's spinning reel, the Xfinity Speed Stick. It's a pretty cheap combo from Walmart. It's like $68 or something. Got them the other day, thought I'd give them a try. And they're a little soft for that fish, but they do work pretty nice for some of the smaller largemouth and smallmouth. And the worms I'm using, make sure I don't hit any rocks, using the Yum Dingers. These guys, they work pretty excellent. I love throwing worms. Worms can catch smallmouth or largemouth. And heck, sometimes you can get pike or a gar. You can catch all kinds of stuff on them. Walleye occasionally too. They're, they're good lures, so definitely try them. Hope you enjoyed today's video we are seven miles from where we started hooked like eight fish today only reeled in one but the other ones were all small rock bass and little bluegill fun time out here uh, that one fish three and a half easily three and a half uh, sun's come out we're starting to get into more of that laker territory so we're gonna head off the water now hope you enjoyed numbers wasn't there quantity no good quality very very impressive today so thanks for watching y'all i hope you enjoyed this video of me catching what was likely my pb smallie but we'll never know take a guess down below what you think the weight was i'm guessing three and a half to four but you just never know at least 20 inches it was a big big fish so thanks for watching y'all we'll catch you on the next one